Question 6. An aqueous solution of cobalt 2 correct uh, is pink color due to the presence of uh, hexa aqua cobalt 2 ions, okay, which is this one, the pink color. Complete table 6.1. Uh, to describe what is observed when the name reagent is added to this uh, solution. Okay, the first reagent is the uh, sodium hydroxide solution. When it's added to this uh, complex ion solution, so you will see blue precipitate. So the color for cobalt containing product is blue and the state of the uh, this cobalt containing product is solid because it's blue precipitate. Uh, something like this. Right, this one. So means when you add the sodium hydroxide, it will form this blue precipitate. And of course, follow the equations here uh, in part two. Uh, the hexa aqua cobalt two ions uh, with the two hydroxide will form this uh, precipitate. So it's cobalt with four H2O and two hydroxide. And of course, uh, you have the balance equation plus two H2O means two H2O has been exchanged. Or you can just put uh, the cobalt uh, with two hydroxide and all the water has been exchanged. And uh, part three is about uh, this sec uh, second reagent. Okay, second reagent is the excess of concentrated HCl added. So you see blue uh, color and it's a blue solution. Okay, the state is aqueous. When you add concentrated HCl to this hexa aqua cobalt 2, so you it's from pink to this blue solution. Right? So it's a solution, uh, not precipitate, it's clear. No precipitate here, it's clear solution. So means uh it's follow this equation. Uh cobalt uh this uh, hexa aqua cobalt 2 ion with four chloride from this uh, tetrachloral cobalt ion and uh, 6 H2O right so this one is soluble and uh, is a solution okay now part B1 define stability constant so this one is very easy the equilibrium constant for the formation of a complex ion form is constituent ion okay uh, let's use this example the complex ions that form let's say is uh, this one and we want to know how stable is this uh, complex ion form by comparing to the concentration of this with the uh, hexa aqua cobalt 2 ion. So it means the care step expression is going to be the concentration of the complex ion that form uh, so uh, over the, the concentration of this uh, constituent ion so it's the hexa aqua cobalt 2 and times the uh, this concentration of ammonia so power 6 so this one is uh, actually similar to the the KC but we don't include the concentration of water because water is a constant right so we just use the ligands and the complex ions that involve uh, that involve in the reaction part 3 give the units of the stability uh, constant uh, of this uh, hexaamine uh, cobalt uh, 2 complex ion um, so this one is uh, you just need to use the mol per dm cube right so it's uh, mol per dm cube this one over mol power 7 okay dm power negative 21 right because here is 7 here so therefore eventually you get mole power negative 6 dm 18 power 18 part 4 the cash step value for uh, this complex ion is uh, 7.7 .7 times 10 power 4 uh, in the aqueous solution the concentration of this complex ion is 0 0.074 and the concentration of ammonia is 0 0.48 mole per dm cube Calculate the concentration of this, uh, the hexa aqua cobalt 2 ion. Um, this one is uh, quite easy. You just need to substitute all the values that are given uh, in this expression and rearrange. So this one, again, this one already given, uh, which is 0 0.074. 
and this one already given which is uh, 0 0.48 so you need to get this one right care step already given so rearrange substitute all the values inside so you get uh, 7 point uh, 86 times 10 power 35 more PTMQ. Okay, that's all. Thank you.